as you know, uh, Guam's uh, foster care system is really strained. And uh, many of these social workers have hundreds of cases that they're dealing with and whatever we can do to make it smoother um, that that is our goal and also to bring out awareness uh, with the public letting them know the need that is a mission of the kate thomas foundation founder and president kathleen beneventi said that thomas was not only a social worker but her foster mother i guess i wanted uh, people to remember her dedication to human services and uh, especially helping uh, abuse women and children and um, that was more of her passion and I didn't uh, want people to forget forget her name. The mission of the foundation? We try to fill the gap of uh, the daily needs of foster children that are within the system, uh, shelters or uh, are with relative uh, placements um, to assist with their uh, daily needs like personal hygiene items, formula, baby wipes, and so forth. And also to assist the social worker who is in the process of removing a child. And with that removal, sometimes there are items that are needed foundation collects such items by way of donation drives and stocks a closet that social workers have access to. It's such a big deal and uh, we want to fill that gap so that's um, how the Kate Thomas Foundation uh, plays within the foster community. Over the past several months the group One Pacific has played a huge role with getting the word out about the foundation and it hasn't gone unnoticed. They've really been advocating, getting us out there in the, um, at the same time also getting many, many small businesses uh, involved. And um, it has uh, helped uh, get the word out. And it, it's amazing. It's amazing to see the outpour of support that they're really a lot of them say they had no idea how um, strained the system was. With that being said, there is a huge need for foster parents. Beneventi says one of the things that holds people back from becoming one is that they're fearful, fearful of getting connected to the child. They're like, oh, I don't want to, I'm scared. What if I get connected? What if uh, I love them? But that's the whole point is we want you to be connected. We want, it, we want you to, to love them. It might be temporary for you, but it's a lifetime impact on that child, and they'll never forget it. And uh, trust me when I say they'll never forget it. And if there's anything she would want you to know? So what I would like to say is uh, you don't have to be a licensed foster home. Uh, you can do respite care where you can pick these uh, children up uh, on the weekend just to share a beach day with them or a dinner or a movie day. Um, all these little things uh, the, uh, become forever moments, right? And so don't be afraid to reach out and just uh, mentor and let them know that uh, they haven't been forgotten and that um, they are loved.